आर यू रेडी टू टेक योर स्किल्स टू द नेक्स्ट लेवल एंड बिकम ए टॉप परफॉर्मर सॉफ्टवेयर टेस्टर इफ द आंसर ऑफ दिस क्वेश्चन इज येस इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गो डिस्कस अबाउट दी वन थिंग द वन थिंग दैट यू हैव टू बेसिकली डू टू बिकम अ ग्रेट सॉफ्टवेयर टेस्टर ऑल राइट लेट्स गेट स्टार्ट सो सी इन दिस वीडियो द फंडा विल बी वेरी सिंपल एंड इट इज वन ऑफ दी येट पॉवरफुल टेक्निक दैट जनरली आई बेसिकली हैव इम्प्लीमेंटेड टू बिकम ए ग्रेट सॉफ्टवेयर टेस्टर एंड आई थिंक दिस विल बी हेल्पफुल फॉर यू ऑल राइट द आंसर फॉर दिस इज द वन थिंग दैट आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट इज pro activeness which is you have to be proactive in multiple multiple things pramod can you give us some example so here are the examples and in the end i'm going to give you my bonus tips also how i was more more proactive how i got more salary how i got uh, multiple new more opportunities because of this skill that i have basically added to my journey overall in this software testing all right that proactiveness right so what exactly it means proactiveness basically means owning the responsibility of a project right overall in the context of software testing i'm talking about right but overall the definition of proactiveness basically means you are ready before even something is starting right you are proactive right before even something is starting you have basically read about it you have research about it you know the important concepts right so for example suppose a new project is basically getting started in your company right then as a proactive software tester what you will do is you will just read about the requirement early you will basically think about the estimation early you will think about okay who is going to test what you is going to test and that's what exactly proactiveness means so what i have done i was basically owning the responsibility of a overall project i was so proactive i basically started creating test plan initially i started creating In test cases added there if there are some improvements which are basically present uh, they wanted into the project right i started adding that right so in terms of manual testing i basically have done these things where i was helping them in preparing the test plan right even i was working as a software tester i was helping my qa lead to do some proactive work where we were helping it to create the test plan that's what i have done in the documentation i basically helped them right when we talk about in automation i was helping them what to automate and what not to automate and i was just helping my next level who's like my manager right in preparing their automation coverage if there are missing bugs those things and all right if there there is a production bug i was responsible for it i took so responsibility i basically added all the rcas even it was not missed by me so again why i was doing this right and what i actually got from this right trust me this is one of the skill that helped me to add more value to the team it basically increased my visibility it basically added that promotion Mohit is very serious person. He basically take care of everything, right? I added my dependency to the project by basically introducing this skill, which is proactiveness, right? So overall conclusion, the reason I'm telling you this, all this thing, right? If you are watching this, right, you have to be proactive in your projects. As a software tester, this is recommended from the day one, where you are proactive in terms of projects, owning responsibility, communication, adding bugs, bug raising, discussion, risk. all these things you have to be proactive let me tell you one important thing so there was a communication gap between developers and testers so basically couple of testers had it some bugs but developers basically missed it or they were not doing it and we are on the words to release it then i took this uh, proactiveness where i think okay uh, if these bugs are not fixed they will be basically added to the production so i basically called a meeting as a proactiveness right i basically told them okay this is a bug please resolve it and all and i got a recognition for due to that so now you can imagine right whenever you are proactive you prepare yourself before starting out something new right then definitely it will give you a edge as compared to other people so this is what you have to do i hope you got something new from this video if you if you got something new give me a like and tell me in the comment if you think that proactiveness is one of the important skill that every software tester should have and this is actually the one thing that will make you better software tester if you agree just give me agree in the comment if you disagree you can disagree and you can write what other skills that you think should be part of your software testing life cycle okay like and subscribe for this kind of video if you are new please subscribe and like to the video if you are already existing subscriber thanks a lot for joining i'll see you in the next video